This is why I can't speak. This is why I'm a crackhead. Okay, what? Pussy. Shit. Ah, don't you dare knock over my coffee. What's cracking? What's poppin'? It's your girl, LC. I hate myself for doing that. Okay, ladies and gents. Ladies and gents, today, as we can tell by the title, blah, 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 it's a Q&A time! Woo! <laughs> yeah, um, so I hit 100 subscribers! Ah! I know, 100's like, it's just 100. Like, people have like 10,000, whatever. I'm not gonna undermine my progress. I started with zero and now I have 100. Why not do a Q&A? For you guys to get to know me, because you're probably like, who the hell is this bitch? We don't even know anything about her. We just watch her be a dumbass on YouTube. So, like, let's at least know who this dumbass is. <laughs> I had you guys in Huava send me questions on Instagram and on Twitter just to, like, ask me things that you would like to know about me. It sounds so conceited. Like, ask me questions about myself. <laughs> I love talking about me. Um, if you want to send me questions whenever I do a next q and I'll link my Instagram and Twitter down below in the description box. That sounds like so YouTuber-ish, right? <laughs> but anyway, so if you do want to send questions in, like, yeah, feel free. That's how you'll do it. Okay. First, we need a little bit of coffee. So good. All right, let's go. So the first question, or like the one question I was getting asked the most, was why did you want to do YouTube or why did you start YouTube and who inspired you? So this question, I'm doing it first because this is probably has a lot of explanation. So I gotta backtrack a lot. <sighs> Let me, I feel like this is gonna be so hard for me to explain because I don't know how to correlate my thoughts. So they're gonna be like all over the place, but just bear with me here. I've always made videos, like always made just little videos of me and my friends doing like dumb shit. I would videotape everything me and my friends would do. Then I would like edit them all fun and stuff together. And like, I don't think I would post them anywhere. I think we would just keep them on my computer. But this was before like YouTube was, oh, let me backtrack. This was when I was in seventh grade, like sixth and seventh grade that I actually started like putting editing videos together. So this was when I was like 12, so like 11 years ago. So being a YouTuber and like having a YouTube channel, at least as a career, was not a thing. So I stumbled across this guy, his name was, I guess this is the person who did inspire me to upload onto YouTube. Um, his name is the computer nerd 01, Josh. I don't know his last name, but Josh. Ah, I I'm, feel like I'm confusing everybody. This channel that I have right now is not my first YouTube channel. I've literally had three other channels before this. My first one was like, was called Cuppy Cake 33. That was my YouTube channel in like seventh grade. And like I said, this was before being a YouTuber was a thing. Like I literally would just go and make videos of me and my friends and put them online because it was easier for friends to see it that way. That, that YouTube channel's still up. So the videos are still up there somewhere. I'll try to find them and like link them or whatever. So then when I found out you could like make a career off being a YouTuber, I was like, why would I not make a career off something that I want to do that I've always loved doing since I was little. So then I created a second YouTube channel when I was in college. That didn't go too well just because I don't think I had really like found myself yet. So I was just like, I would watch YouTubers and then I would like try to emulate their videos. Like I just didn't really know the style of video I wanted to do yet. That channel's still up. I think it's like Lauren Christine or something. I'll link that one as well. But like when you watch those videos, you could totally just tell that I was not myself or just like not how I am now as if my channel has such great content. Three hours later. Longest explanation ever. So let me just, let me, I think I could like paraphrase this. The Computer Nerd 01 inspired me to make videos and then which later I put onto YouTube in like literally 10 years ago for my friends to see. And then I had a YouTube channel then where I just upload for fun, like not even, it's just for fun. And then I found out you could make a career off doing that. So I was like, yeah, I'm gonna make a career off doing something that I've always wanted to do and I've loved doing. So then I made my 
second YouTube channel in like, I don't know, my freshman or sophomore year of college, and then that didn't go too well, and now I'm here. So, I've been like a YouTuber, quote unquote, like I've been uploading on YouTube for over, for 10 years now. So this isn't really anything new to me, it's just I think now I know I want to, like the direction I want to go in. Yeah. Does that make sense? I hope so because I am not going to state that all over again. What YouTubers do you watch? I feel like I go through big phases of watching people on YouTube. Like right now I'm in a very, very big Curtis Connor um, YouTube phase. So I've been watching his videos like religiously. Always watch Cody Ko. Um, I guess like commentary videos. I think they're really funny. Like Cody Ko, Danny Gonzalez, Curtis Connor. I do watch the Dolan twins. I feel really weird saying that because they are younger than me. But like their videos are really, really like entertaining. I think they're entertaining. Um, I watch Sarah Baska. She's so fucking funny. I love Sarah Baska, especially when she was a minor. Like, I don't know. I feel like me and Sarah Baska would be fucking BFFs. So watch her shit. Um, Keen and JC, they are, I've been watching Keen and JC for a while now. What did you go to college for? Good question, if y'all didn't know, I went to college. I am a college graduate. I have a bachelor's degree. I know, it's hard to think that a crackhead like me has a freaking degree, but I do. Um, I went to college to teach. I majored in liberal studies because my college didn't have like an education major, but it's pretty much the same thing. So yeah, I went to college to be a teacher. Could y'all see me being a freaking teacher? Like, come on. I feel like that terrifies people when I tell them that. Are you making money off YouTube? I'm not making money off YouTube, no. Um, I only have 100 subscribers and like I don't get a lot of views. No, I, I do this out of pure enjoyment and love for making videos and I'm not even exaggerating or kidding. It's, like a, it's a creative outlet, I like it. It's like a good way to spend my time because I'm not really doing anything right now since it's summer. But you know what I'm saying? Like, no, I don't make money off YouTube. That would be nice to make money off YouTube. Like, I mean, that's kind of like the end game is to make this my career. Like, a, you know, I can make my living off this. So subscribe <laughs> to help me. You help me. God, I hate myself. Favorite band, the 1975, obviously. Um, Maddie Healy is just lyrically amazing. Lainey, I love Lainey so much. Their music always puts me in a good mood. Do you have any tattoos or piercings? I do have tattoos and piercings. I have five tattoos and I have three piercings. All my tattoos are hidden besides this one. Probably gonna get more one day. I will get more one day. For sure I'm gonna get more. Um, they're just expensive and they hurt and I'm a big ass baby, so yeah. Someone said, acne treatments. How is your skin so nice? Um, my skin is not nice. I do break out. Uh, I don't really have any type of acne treatments I use. This is my best advice for if you're breaking out. So depending on where in your face you're breaking out, you can kind of tailor it down to what the reasons are. Like if it's the mouth and chin area, that's hormonal. So sometimes there's nothing you can do about that. You might have to go on medication. Um, if it's like your cheeks, usually I don't, that might be from food. I'm not 100%, but I know it could be like dirty pillowcases, your phone, touching your face, just dirty things touching your face. So that as well. Um, your forehead is like stress area. So depending on where you're breaking out that can say a lot. Um, my best advice to someone who is breaking out, one, I would say cut dairy out of your diet. Like literally cut dairy out of your diet. Dairy is so bad, not only for your body, but it is for your skin, it causes you to break out. So try that if that doesn't work. No, I'm just kidding. What's your favorite healthy meal? So if you're wondering, why is this girl asking you about healthy meals? Believe it or not, um, I posted on my Instagram story that I have lost 17 pounds. So I think after seeing that picture, she just wanted to know like, oh, like what do you eat? You, bit, you put chicken in a pan and like over the stove with zucchini, Hello, zucchini. bell peppers, onions, and then you put, oh, crushed tomatoes in there. So then you put crushed tomatoes with a little bit, you know, sprinkle some oregano and garlic in there. Kind of like toss it all up, cook it a bit in the pan, and then 
yeah and it's oh and then you top it with marinara sauce and like a little bit of basil so good. you got your veggies your protein it's healthy because it's not like fried it's like cooked in the pan but if you guys would like me to do a video on like foods and workouts and just tips overall to like help you lose weight i don't like saying lose weight but help you like reach a fitness goal or whatever um definitely leave a comment and let me know I'm not saying i'm like a fitness guru i'm definitely not like a nutritionist or anything like that but just like tips that helped for me so yeah what is your dream job so my dream job is this youtube i would love to make this a career like ever since i was little i wanted a talk show like i really wanted to like be a talk show host and like just have people come in like i'm not even celebrities just like talk to people and like ask them weird ass questions and play games and stuff so it's like why not like that's kind of what having a youtube channel pretty much is you get what i'm saying so yeah this this is my dream job doing it not getting paid for it but i'm doing it working it she needs to stop talking what's the strangest thing you've done yeah um a lot of things oh my god okay i know i definitely know me and my friends were walking to the grocery store because we were hungry and this is before like either of us had licenses so we were walking to the store and it was, just, it was a long walk but we're like whatever haha -ha. and then like halfway through we were like we don't want to walk anymore like we don't so we saw a car drive by we flagged them down and got in two two men two guys don't know who they were got into their car and had them drop us off at the grocery store that's not even like a, a strange thing that's just like a dumb thing to do and a scary thing to do like why would you do that oh my gosh like i was a dumb ass 15 year old so yeah but there's a lot of strange things i yeah a lot like a whole list of things i could say mainly due to when i used to go out and like party a lot when i was younger so if you guys want a video on all the strange things i did when i was a cool party girl um comment let me know that'd be kind of fun to do last question probably my favorite question i got uh why are you a crackhead and you know what girly i could not tell you why i am a crackhead it's just the way my mind works I am legit an ADD kid, like was diagnosed with ADD. So my mind just cannot form coherent and like logical thoughts. Like they're just, I think of 12 things at the one time I'm talking. <laughs> She's cracking. She's a cracking. <laughs> that was fun. I love being a little narcissistic for a couple minutes. This is a good time. Let's do this again sometime. <laughs> um, if you want to participate in the next Q&A that I do when I don't know when that will be but um, you know, would like to send in some questions what, <laughs> what was that sentence um, go ahead my social medias are down below everything's Elsie Posey pretty much but I'll link them so yeah you can send me in questions crazy kiddos ask me go away ask whatever you want go away <laughs> I meant to say fire away or go ahead. This is why I can't speak. This is why I'm a crackhead. Thanks for watching. Um, feel free to subscribe if you want. Don't feel pressured to because we're not about peer pressure here. But if you're going to do anything, make sure you do something to save the earth, save your planet. I don't know what that is. Whether it's using less water, you recycle, use metal straws even though it's been told that that won't make any difference but if that's what makes you feel good and you're at least doing a little bit of something do you i'll see you guys next time have a good ass fucking day all right bye <laughs>